welcome back to my channel. Um, today I'm coming at you my plum paper planner for 2017 just arrived. Um, literally just got this on the porch, so really excited. Um, box is wonderful as always. It looks a little different than last year. This was purple, as was this. Um, so the boxes have changed slightly. They're a little smaller too, which is kind of nice that it's a little more compact. Um, I've already cut the box open, have not looked inside yet, so you guys will get to look inside with me. Um, as always, they package in bubble wrap. Um, got a little thank you card here. Box out of the way. Um, and it comes in cellophane. Um, I got a 12 month planner, starts in January of 2017 and ends in December. Um, this is a little, it's got some gunk or something on it, it's a little disappointing. Um, but it's not a big deal, not a huge deal. Um, my last plum paper that I got did not have like the frosted cover and didn't have the thick plastic cover either. It was when they were just doing this and then shortly after I got my planner is when they gave you the option to add um, this clear coated cover and then after that it just came standard. So that's nice. Um, this feels thick. I have a lot of Erin Condren covers, so I'm not sure if I will be using this cover or not, but this is the cover that I chose. It's the um, Teal Weave, and I did get my name put on it, and I asked them to leave the year off. Um, so inside, just like a herringbone pattern right here. Um, paper feels amazing. It's one of my favorite things about this planner. Um, you have your year to glance for 2017. Um, then it goes right into the special dates section. Um, then you have your ideas, plans, and goals. I'm not sure what I'll use this for yet, but I do want to utilize this section um, because I think it's a really nice addition. Um, my last year's version didn't have any of this, so really happy to see that. Then you have a blank notes page before the planner starts. Um, as I said, I started mine in January. Um, this part is nothing new. It's got the um, monthly highlights, your three goals, birthdays, events, things to remember, and then you can design two of your own categories. Plus you have your um, notes page for the month. Um, but what I'm really enjoying is the reformat of the monthly page. It, had, it used to have like two boxes here. Um, and it doesn't have that anymore and it goes all the way up to the top um, so looks really nice they put their um, holidays in here really streamlined it it looks really nice um, they took out um, the wording that was right here and so you can put a header here and have it do whatever you want. They still left the notes thing here. I kind of wish they would just leave or put this all the way down. So maybe in the next version that they have come out, um, they will do that. And um, I love that they took the word checklist out of the bottom. Um, I will probably still cover it up with washi because it's the easiest place to put washi, but I love that they took those words off so it won't show through the washi, which will be nice. Um, color schemes are the same. I did add, uh, after every month, I added a bill tracking page, one of my favorite add-ons. Um, but the color schemes look to be the same as last year. Flip through really quick, just so you can see what each month is. And we've got June. July, August, September, October, 
October. November is probably my favorite color. Very pretty, like teal color. And then mine runs through December of 2017. Um, the add-ons that I got this year were the fitness section. I got it last year and really enjoyed it, or should I say this year, um, and really enjoyed it. Um, basically, you know, you have your monthly tracking pages. Um, you put your weight in, your monthly goals, your measurements, notes, this month's fitness plan, highs and lows and rewards. Um, and then every day of the month, um, you have a spot to write what you did for exercise and track your water. Um, the beginning is like your start date, your start weight, start BMI, end date, end pounds, and end BMI measurements, um, long-term goals, short-term goals, affirmation statement, motivation, and milestones with a reward. Um, so that's really cool. And then I got 10 mm, uh, extra note pages in the tabs. Let me make sure I get to the end of this here. Yeah. And then something new this year they did um, was dot grid. They added in like three, I think, pages. Yep, three pages of dot grid. You have your passwords page, my contacts, US holidays for 2017, 18, and 19. And then a year to glance for 2018 and then they redesigned their folder with a higher um, pocket which looks really nice um, it's really good quality um, I ended up ripping out the other pocket last year and putting one of the Erin Condren clip-in folders in I don't think I'll do that this year because I think this one is a lot better quality than it used to be um, so it's actually really really nice and then it just has the back cover with the clear plastic that has scuffs in it, which is, like I said, okay, it's not a big deal. Um, I'm a little disappointed with this. I don't know if you can see this. I'll bring it up close. See that right there? That scuff mark. And then they've got another one folded right there. Um, so that's the only thing that I noticed that was wrong. It looks like everything else looks fine. Um, but like I said, this won't be a big deal. I mean, I'm not going to have them resend me a, a whole nother planner just for the front cover being a little scuffed up. Um, but all in all, I'm really um, satisfied with this planner and I can't wait to start using it and pre-planning in it because I've already got sticky notes in this current year's planner for stuff that's starting at the beginning of this year. So I was really happy that this got here. Um, I ordered, I want to say it was Friday, November 4th, I think that was the date. Um, I got a shipping notice on the 9th and it wasn't even scheduled to be here until tomorrow, which is the 16th, and today is the 15th, so it got here a day early. Um, I chose standard shipping, um, so that's the slowest shipping. I'm in Michigan, um, and it was coming from California, so that was pretty good. Also, the um, folks at Plum Paper were kind enough to give me a coupon code to um, share with my subscribers for 10% off from now until January 15th of 2017. Um, so I will put that code down in the description box below. Um, as always, if you like the video, give me a thumbs up and hit the red subscribe button below for more videos from me. But this is my walkthrough of my new plum, plum paper planner for 2017, uh, my unboxing video. And until next time, I'll see you later. Bye.